Now that we've killed the Gamma Boss, it's time for us to take on the beta. However, for us to do that, we're going to need some items. Items of which are deep inside of some caves. Thank you guys for joining me for this adventure once again in Shadow to Today's Comment of the Day. By Little Shadow Wolf 4086 who said, thank you. This is going to be very useful, and I love this video. Thank you so much, my friend. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. That means, uh, that means a lot. Honestly, yeah, these comments mean a lot. Um, I really do appreciate it, and thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you continue to join my videos, my friend, and uh, let's go ahead and get started. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to yet another episode of Arc Survival Evolve on the Lost Island series. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope your day is going well and marvelous and amazing. I know mine is, and it's going to get even better because today, my friends, is the day we go a little bit more cave diving to get the resources needed to go into the second boss fight, which would be the Beta Dino Pificus. I still cannot say that correctly. Um, but would be the beta version of the Dino Pificus King dude, whatever you make want to call him. But I pretty much call him just a big monkey, all right? The beta version of the big monkey. We're going to be doing that one next. And we just got to prep uh, mainly because we do need the artifacts now. Last, well, not last episode, but a few episodes ago, I went to inside these random caves. And that's pretty much how I got the artifact of the immune along with the artifact of the strong, which means we're missing two artifacts, which I have a list up over here. We're missing the artifact of the brute and the artifact of the hunter. Uh, since we already adventured in the cave of the artifact of the hunter, I'm just going to grab that real quick because I already know the layout of it and know exactly where it's at. But I've never went and found the artifact of the brute. And that's pretty much what we're going to be doing today is going to be the artifact of the brute. I already know where the cave location is. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get the cave diver dinos that we have. And uh, let's go ahead and make our way over there. Speaking of... Uh, I have, I, I figured out how to actually charge the leggings. Pretty much you just get some elemental and you put it in there. And then that pretty much charges it. And when I press down control, I get this super speed boost, which I think is awesome. I think it's awesome. It's a way faster way of traveling versus like hopping on a dinosaur. And some dinosaurs aren't even that fast. The only bad thing you can't really turn when you're doing it. But I mean, that's fine if you're just trying to go from like point A to point B really fast, just like I did, right? I think it's great. Um, but yeah, that's pretty cool as far as like the boots go and everything. I think that's awesome. Um, and apparently you can also walk on water with them. I haven't tried it, but I think that's pretty damn dope if that's true. Um, but I, I figured that since this is going to be one of the harder caves or medium level caves, I'm assuming that, um, wherever the artifacts are, the harder, you know, like the, the harder artifact that you need for the harder bosses, the harder the cave is actually going to be. So I figured I'm going to take myself a second Barry Onyx with me. Um, just in case I have to quickly switch between Barry Onyxes or just in case one of them dies, I could just pull out another one that's really, really strong and I'll be good versus having like two, the Barry Onyx and the Thylacolio like we did last time and almost dying like we did last time. You know what I mean? So um, I'm just going to quickly level this one up and then I will meet you guys at the actual location of where... Uh, where it's at all right guys so we're pretty much where the cave is but we're not exactly at the location but the reason why is because i want to explain where this one is just a little bit differently since i had a really hard time finding it um but pretty much if you look on your map right look at your map you want to go all the way over here all the way until there's no more land and you just see a bunch of water and then you're gonna go into this little uh this little lake this little lake type area here and then it's gonna have like two waterfalls one to the right and then one to the left and you're gonna follow the one to the left and then you're just gonna follow this water stream to the left and you know you're going the right direction when you look up and there's a tree right on top of that little mountain area and then you're just gonna follow this all the way down all the way down here and then boom there is the entrance to the cave and that's pretty much how i personally found the cave oh my god can die die just die just die but yeah that's pretty much how i found the cave um versus like all the videos i watched like three videos i couldn't find it still until i did and i was like yeah i'm just gonna tell people about this um but yeah we're here now and uh, i don't think there's oh yeah my soul gun um i don't think there's anything else on you that i really need let's go ahead and whip out the boys real quickly and you are also gonna go back into my inventory mr may wing there we go so i'm going to need Let's bring out both Baryonyxes along with the uh, Thylacolia. I'm pretty sure that's pretty sure that's all that I need from here. I got my food. I got everything that I um I think I would need at least. I'm gonna hop out on a Thylacolio just because I feel like I feel like I like the um I feel like I like the Baryonyxes more than Thylacolio, but I don't wanna 
I don't want to neglect the thylacoli if that makes any sense. Um, so that's why we're going to be whipping him out today. Put some more in that. We're almost at a thousand protecting attack damage for you, buddy. That's actually pretty damn good. All right. I'm assuming this is going to be like a deserty theme type of cave. And there's bats. I was hoping for... Oh, we got mantises. So we got bats and mantises. Mantises, that's going to be... Mantises are actually going to be pretty damn scary. Considering their first attack does like boatloads of damage. You know what I mean? Um, those are going to be pretty damn scary. Hopefully we're going to the right location here. I'm pretty sure we are. Um... Then we just continue on going this way. I'm, I'm avoiding everything because I don't want to die. That's why I'm avoiding everything. All right, we're in this large area now. Are they following? Yes, they are following me. I got an army behind me. A whole damn army. Whoa! Oh, that didn't do that much. That only did, you know, that didn't do too much. I was expecting like a few hundred. There goes a, a loot crate up there. That's definitely something we're going to have to get. Um, as soon as we come to a stopping point. Oh, this is going to be... This is going to be risky. Oh, we completely just bypass the loot crate area, I see. I'm jumping, I'm hitting at the same time. Jumping and hitting, doing as much damage as I can to whatever I can do damage to at the exact same time. I'm spamming my buttons right now. Here we go, there we go. Let's get out of there. And Thylacola, you'll do your job. Ah, come on, get up there. Woo! All right, we should be able to handle this portion of enemies as long as there's no uh as long as there's no mantis up here we should be good i believe i think okay yeah we're fine we're fine we might actually have to switch already oh there goes my uh there goes my hat we might have to switch already we're already at half health and we haven't even like we haven't even tried to fight any of the mantises Imagine if we were also fighting the mantises down there. Like, that would have been horrible. We might have actually died right then. Come on. Last one. At least we don't have to deal with spiders. That's a, that's a good thing. If we had to deal with spiders, this would have been a whole lot worse, I think. We would have been stuck. We wouldn't be able to move or anything. They just keep crawling up, huh? Look at that. That looks disgusting. Oh my god, that one's trying to almost got up here, actually. I think we should be good, though, to collect whatever's in here. We got a boomerang and some... We got some desert cloth uh, gloves. Those are pretty cool. I think it's the first desert cloth gloves I've gotten. I might actually switch. I think we are, actually. Let's go ahead and switch. I don't want to die out here, right? Let's see. What do we got here? 15,000. You're still healing, so... We're going to take you out, actually. Because I, I don't have... I do not want to die how you took so much damage just from that small little interaction. Ooh, a whip. You took so much damage just from that small little interaction. I'm frightened for you. So we're just going to collect you. And uh, I think we're going to continue out on the Baryonics here. I wish I could use uh, the Baryonics' tail whip ability. That'd be gnarly. I don't know where this goes, though, because I'm pretty sure we were going in two separate directions. The only scary thing about the Baryonics is that it doesn't have the climb ability, right? So it might be a little bit harder for us to get out of sticky situations unless we just straight on fight everything, which is definitely an option we have. Is this an underwater area? Don't tell me we got to go underwater. I mean, we did bring the Baryonyx, so we should be fine going underwater. But I was definitely just not prepared to go underwater. Oh my gosh. We're almost at half health on the, on the Baryonyx. Bro, it's really just the worms. Or the centipedes or whatever. Those guys are no joke. No joke at all. And I did bring me some fish meat with me, so... Hopefully that can help uh, help the Baryonyx a little bit as far as the healing goes. And the rest of my gear has been broken. You freaking worms! Breaking my gear. I think I have some backup gear, but I don't even know if I want to put it on. I just know it's just going to get broken again, really. 
Are we going to have to go underwater? That's what it looks like, like this entire area here. It looks like we're going to have to go underwater for real. Almost got freaking kicked underwater. Hello. All right. Almost everything is cleared from this area. We just got this little guy over here. Well, this is where it, uh, I'm assuming we go under there because that looks like an area we go under. That's where, that's where we were last time to get the first loot crate. Um, I'm going to force feed you some fish meat here just for a little bit. Ooh, I wonder how deep we have to go. Like, should I put my Scooby gear on or no? Hmm. Let's see here. Hopefully we don't have to. And it's just like a small little section. And hopefully it's not like a full blown underwater. It doesn't look like it is, right? Wait, does it just stop here? Wait, what? I think we have to go up there. I, I I'm wait, I'm I'm genuinely confused right now. Do we have to go up there? Or was that like an area before where we would just fall down into the water? Cuz that might have just been an area. No, cuz we didn't we didn't run into any water areas. I have my side of Macrops on me, so I can just fly up there to see what that's all about real fast. I think I'm I think I'm gonna do that. Cause the the artifact could just be up here and chilling, right? Or not. Hey. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So this is just, this extends the cave. This extends, the, this definitely just extends the cave for sure. Um, meet my Baryonyx underwater in my domain, excuse you. But yeah, okay, so that definitely extends the cave because we didn't see that before. So what we're gonna be doing is, I'm gonna take the fish food off of you because that's important. Um, and I'm also gonna take that. Going to need to give my sign of my crop some more food. And let's go. Okay. All right. All right. All right. This is that's interesting. So pretty much you go. I don't know how that works, though, but oh, my gosh. All right. Let's just avoid everything. Oh. This is actually not good. It's going to take everything out here. Everyone attack. Oh, I forgot. I have them on like some weird situation here there we go okay 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 we're fine we're fine definitely was just not expecting that at all um that was a close situation though no, that was a close call that was a close call i'm glad it's a little bit of a water situation because i just used my barrier on because it's a tail whip and and we're good right they all get stunned can't attack me i can attack them it's a perfect time it's a perfect time. All right, let's take two. Let's try this again. Hopefully I can actually get my freaking Baryonyx down. That was not expecting that. This is interesting though. So you go all the way throughout the cave, you get to this water area, and then you have to figure out a way to get up here. I guess with a side of Macrops, grappling hook, maybe even a Thylacolio like I did. Um, you just gotta figure something out and it, it seems to work pretty damn well. We'll put that on you so you can eat it. Um, so we got two ways to go here, actually. We go up or down. I'm assuming we go down because, I mean, it is a cave. But I'm, my curiosity is telling me to go up. Unless this goes outside. Okay, so this just goes outside. So there's two entrances to the cave, apparently. Interesting. Okay, so this is the second entrance. Imagine we go all the way down here and we just end up where we were the first time. I feel like that's about to happen. A little bit, a little bit. I wonder if I could just run past all of these guys real fast. And just completely just bypass battling them all together. Save my energy, save my health. Can I? It seems like I can a little bit. Oh, oh I thought, wait, wait. Water. Oh no, we just gotta hop down here. Okay. Felt like Spider-Man for a second. 
All right, let's just hop by these guys. I'm going to go this way. So maybe I was wrong because everything here is dead. And right there, that's where I got the loot crate the first time. So we're missing something here. Holy shiz. Oh my gosh. There's a lot of everything everywhere. Um. All right. <laughs> All right. We can't go that way. Let's not get trapped here. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Just gotta run right past all of you. What is up here? Gotta pass this way to the right. Does this go back? Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna kill these guys real fast. I gotta figure out a way. It's, we're missing something. There's gotta be like a secret passes or something like that, right? There's something secret that we're missing. I've got no idea what it is. And our teams are running out of health a lot right now. Oh, what is this? We didn't see this the first time, did we? No, we did not. Obviously, we got to go all the way down here. Wait, no, this is where we came the first time. This is how we got in the cave. What are, where are we missing? What are we missing? This is, yeah, this is how we went in the cave. We're missing something here. Can we go under that? I don't know if we could go under that waterfall or not. I might just have to kill everything and like, just to buy me some time to look around or whatnot to really know where we're supposed to go. Cause I've got no idea right now. Um, we're just keep going back and forth and that gives us like two different interests pretty much. I'm gonna kill you because you, you, you stopped me in my tracks. You're annoying. So are you, so are you. Come on. Ah, whatever. What about this way? I don't, did we go this way? Oh, I'm hungry. There we go. Oh yeah, we did. That's the, that's the area we couldn't go through. I remember. And then you just hop down here. Gotta pay attention to my health because that's scary. Maybe we have to go down there? I'm not sure. Come on. Stupid bat. Die. Or whatever. Maybe we have to go down there. Did we go up here last time? This might be our last fight. We're at halfway health. We're going to have to switch soon for sure. I might even have to flee from this. Look how many freaking worms there are. Trying to kill them all. This is going to be close. All right. I think these last two and then I'm switching. Or maybe just that one. Um, Let's get you out. Fish food. All right. Um, Where in the heck are we supposed to go? Because if I'm not mistaken, that just leads. Wait a second. Wait a second. Oh, I did not want to fall. I did not want to fall. Oh my gosh. 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 Don't get stuck. Okay. Cause that's way too many enemies. Way too many. We just came from, yeah, we just came from these ways. So the only directions we could go is either up here or to the left over there. And this, wait, I hear something. Oh, we found it. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. Okay. I wonder if we could just parkour up here. Wow. That was like easy, but hard at the exact same time. That was, that was 
That was annoying. <laughs> that was like easy but hard at the exact same time to actually get up here. Like what? Unless I'm just blind or something. But either way, artifact of the brew is ours. Let's go. Um, just for like fun, I'm gonna try to actually kill everything uh, in that area that we saw. Man, just in this small little crevice too. We should be able to kill everything. It's not even a small curve. This is a big curve. I guess it's just like, I just overlooked it the first time or something. Woo! Look at everything down there. I, I wish there was water down there. Actually, you know what I should do? I should take out my thylacolio and everything. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Let's take out the baryonyx. Take out the thyla. We're gonna whistle everything on attack my target. Or just do that. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Nice. All right. Now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. Now we can. Now we can. Uh, now we can take everything out. Here we go. Here we go. I'm just doing it just to do it for no reason. Just because I can. Just because I can. Oh, I love it. You love to see it. You love to see it. Come on, all these damn worms. Every single last one of them's got to go, guys. Every single last one of them. Take them out. Take them out. Let's go. Get gone. Get dead. <laughs> I like how they're just following me and attacking everything I attack. That's pretty damn cool. Instead of attacking, like, whatever they want to attack. I think that's nice. This one... Oh, wait. They, they, they're busy. They're definitely busy. All right, all right. All right, guys. Let's actually... Um, those two snakes on top of each other. Let's go this way, actually. I, I'm pretty sure this will lead me outside. It's a worm with a blue head. That was. I'm actually surprised there was only one loot crate, though. Oh, snap. My health is low. What the world? I was like, what is that heartbeat noise? It's my health that's low because I, I I'm getting attacked. I'm getting hit by the bats, apparently. That is dangerous. I think we should be fine until we actually leave the cave, though. I believe. I, I hope so. There we go. And I'm assuming... Did we fall from here? Yeah, I think we actually fell from here. Is my health slowly dying, going down? Oh, my Baroness was actually killed? Well, that sucks. That sucks a lot. It's okay, though. I, I got plenty more Baryonyxes at home. I could breed up a few more. Um, as long as my Thyla doesn't die, because I, I definitely don't have a lot of Thylas at home. So those guys dying or you dying would be bad, actually. And we can skip them, Thyla. I should pick up my Thyla and just like make a break for it. Uh, okay, here we go. This is the exit. So we just gotta, we just got, oh, yeah, yeah, Okay, yeah. All right, Tyler. Thank you for fighting with me. I'll pick you up real quick. It's time for me to go ahead and skadilly daddle on out of here. I'm pretty sure this is the way out. This looks. Yeah, what? Yeah, 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 this is the way out. So I go through here. Let me, let me just make sure. I go through here and then... There's the bridge, and then I could just leave through the bridge, I'm pretty sure, right? Right, right. Yeah, there's a bridge. All right, I'm going to go ahead and head back home. And I'll see you guys once, uh, once I actually get there. All right, guys, instead of going home, I actually figured that I would, uh, I would just go to the obelisk, uh, and just put everything in here just to see what we're actually missing, uh, before we can actually, um, do the boss. I don't think i'm missing anything to be honest um we have our artifacts so if we are missing anything it'll just be like one of the one of these little things little trophy situations um put that in there okay yeah we're not missing anything all right 
we can go ahead and do this. I'm definitely going to be doing this next episode. So make sure you guys check that out. Um, but but yeah, we can go ahead and do this. I'm a little bit excited for it. Level 75. We're going to unlock more Tetgram things, which is going to be freaking awesome. This one is going to be insane, though, because we are definitely going to have to do some farming for that. Um, but doing the beta is going to be awesome other than that i appreciate you guys watching this episode thank you thank you thank you and i will please ignore the random gear i didn't feel like repairing anything but i will see you guys back on the next episode thank you so much guys and peace